morning, OHS. Today is Friday, April 5th, and it's a B-Day. Coming up on today's show, we will highlight an Earth Day writing contest, a French club meeting, a freshman the freshman class candy, a Spanish club meeting, and the Acceptance Coalition lollipop. Before we get on with our announcements, let's hand it over to Jack with today's weather. Thanks, Carson. Huck. It was cool this morning, and the temperature should remain about the same for the entire day. Taking a look at the five-day forecast, There'll be a high of 43 and a low of 40 with some scattered showers throughout the day. The rest of the week should start to warm up until Tuesday where the weather will drop. I mean, the temperature will drop. Now let's come back to the desk with the rest of the announcements. Thanks, Jack. So, Huck, I hear you're on a diet? Yes, it's a lifestyle change. Well, how's the new lifestyle change going? Carrots. I like eating. It's eating healthy. Well... Mm -hmm. I'll take that into account. Yep. Let's get on with the rest of our announcements. French Club will be meeting Wednesday, April 10th. Any students who wish to order a t-shirt should bring Miss Coletta $6 in room 258 by Friday, April 12th at the latest. The Acceptance Coalition will be selling lollipops next week. <laughs> they will be two, two for $1. See any member or stop by room 260 for more details. The Oswego Environmental Club and the Riverside Bookstore are hosting a writing contest for students in Oswego. For questions and, submission, email, and submissions, email Mrs. Celeste at the email on the screen. Now over to Hulk with the rest of your announcements. Spanish Club will meet again after school Tuesday, April 9th in room, room 234. We will be, dis we'll be discussing the upcoming Gucci and Hawk candy chocolate bar sales. <laughs> Attention all freshmen who sold Gucci and Hawk candy for Easter. The candy should be ready for pickup. Please see Mrs. Richardson in room 151 to pick it up. Today is also the last day freshman class will be also selling Instagrams. <laughs> so, Huck, it's Friday, another edition of the Weekly Buck. Are What's you ready? the Weekly Buck? The Weekly Buck is the longer, more entertaining show here at the WBUC. So, let's go take a, let's go take a look at the preview. Hey, Tori, uh, do you like chase ball? Anthony, what are you talking about? Isn't it baseball, not chase ball? The 2019 MLB season is underway. Spring training was filled with many exciting moments and plays, and we are very excited for how the season will go. The Unified Sports Program is with students with intellectual disabilities and general education students that help promote an authentic experience for all people that are involved in the sport. Oswego High School's annual JV show was held on March 29th and 30th. As always, there were many talented acts. MCs were Jack Rice, Molly Fitzgibbons, and Kat McGreevy. The show began at 7 and admission was $5. All the money collected from ticket sales will benefit the junior class. OHS history teacher, Mr. DiLorenzo, organized the show for the first time this year. To catch the rest of the show, tune to WBUC Cable Channel 16. <laughs> <laughs> page. No, Jack with your sports. Thanks, guys. Baseball has a home game today and tomorrow. Be sure to come out and support your Bucks. The girls lacrosse team lost a close match last night, 24-0, where the boys lacrosse team also lost tonight, 14-10. That's all for your sports and show. Have a good day, OHS. Just so far back and what tanks to be great Faith is what you call that So now it's time to do a bit I'm talking all caps in this camp town No man to bother but I swear I'm what and all that Man I got driving I don't need to switch lanes Always kept some big dreams Been like that since fifth grade Yeah they say I'm good now but man